freaking allergies. Yo, my eyes are dilated right now. Driving while your eyes are dilated isn't like the worst thing, especially since the sun is not out. But like, why do people got their high beams on? I got a quest. Uh, I got a quest. Sports, I'm already not obsessed with sports, so that's out. Religion, I'm not religious, so that's out. Nothing to obsess over that. So the only thing left is money, sex, and food. And I have to pick these as obsessions, absolute obsessions. I feel as though if I pick money, I would turn out to be a really, 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 really bad person because it would be, I would end up being greedy and sure I'd have a lot of money, but I wouldn't have any friends. I mean, I don't really have any friends now. I got like, like three and a half friends, something like that, give or take, but I'm broke. With sex, I, uh, that's a problem. I'm gonna mess around and get one of these super STDs. Y'all know that super gonorrhea is a real thing, right? That's not like a meme that's just made up. Super gonorrhea is a real thing. I don't want that because you can't cure that. And I feel as though if I have an obsession with sex, I'm gonna run in to some girl who got it, unfortunately. And I don't, I don't want it. I didn't ask for that. I, I'm obsessing over a good time with intercourse, not the diseases that come with it. I don't want that. So I don't think I want an obsession with sex. Like maybe an obsession with food because I could always work out and burn it off, but I would get fat and my arteries would be screaming at me every time I eat something like no no more cut it out we don't need this this is your third box of pizza today I'm not trying to repeat what we went through last week it's really between food and money because I would have enough money to go to a psychologist to keep my greed and my obsession under control and I would be able to buy whatever food that I want and I could go on trips, and I could go, I could, I could do whatever feasibly if I get an obsession with money. That's providing I get rich, given my obsession. Now, if I'm just obsessed and I stay broke forever, then there's something drastically wrong with me. You know what, I'm gonna go with food because you can't eat money. I mean, you can, but it, like, it, I, I assume it doesn't taste good. I've never eaten it before. I'm sure somebody out there has I'm sure plenty of people out there have. I wouldn't do it. Money is disgusting. Just like touching, like if you know what money goes through when it gets touched, and like not everybody washes their hands, but not everybody washes their food. Oh my God. Like the more I think about this, I'm trying to bring like positives out, but there's just equally as many negatives as there are positives. Who's not washing their food? Wash your hands, wash your food. Yeah, I think I'll go with food though. Cause I have like, I have favorite foods. Pizza, chocolate cake, bacon, uh, salmon, bacon cheeseburgers, pizza with bacon on it. A lot of bacon related things, which like you could understand why your arteries and your heart and pretty much the rest of your body would be upset with you but it would be an enjoyable slow death and i think that's the real takeaway from this obsession which is why i'm going with it there's no smooth death with the money but like if i catch a heart attack you best believe it tasted good like in sports like you could get hit in the head and that's it like you're dead uh money they do crazy stuff religion same thing sex you gonna mess around catch all the diseases have way more than super gonorrhea, have like super ultra mega syphilis or something, and nobody wants that. And that's mad medicine you gotta take just to keep it like normal. How do you have normal syphilis? I don't want it at all. So that's why I'm going with food. Leave a comment and tell me why, like really tell me why. And I just like pick one, like I wanna know your reason behind the craziness of this obsession that you've picked.